Hey, I'm uh, on the top of one of the trickiest, hardest mountains of the United Kingdom. It's called Trefan. Uh, oh, I can't swap the camera. Anyway, I can't show you much as uh, we are sort of in a mist, in a clouds. But these two rocks behind me, I was on the top of them. I jumped from one onto another one. And uh, those two rocks indicate that this is Trifan. So, yeah, yeah, I'm on the top of this one. And uh, I'm right on the edge of it. So, right down below, it's death. <laughs> well, I've been on this mountain uh, three months ago in, Septem in September. But I was with a group of uh, not so experienced climbers, so we couldn't make it all the way to the top but today i've done it today is the uh, 20th of december christmas is near so yeah I'm here woohoo done it <laughs> and that's sort of a warm-up uh before tomorrow's climb as tomorrow we'll be climbing the uh, crib gosh that should be even more scarier mountain. so we'll see how it goes but today i'm happy i've done this Hey fun! <laughs> Good morning again. Another day and another mountain. We are at the bottom of uh, Crib Grosh. We are here, Penny Pass car park here. So we'll be walking along this uh, red route. And it goes all the way zigzagging to the top of Snowdon, but we'll uh, we'll be cutting here, crossing here this ridge, and we'll be trying to reach Kribgosh, the peak of Kribgosh. It's a bit lower than uh, Snowdon, but uh, it's uh, way more dangerous. Even here, you see exclamation mark. It says uh, Kribgosh is an extremely serious knife-edged ridge. It is best left to experienced walkers with the proper equipment. Okay, so uh, I'm not consider myself as a, an experienced uh, climber, but I'll try my best. I'll try to reach this. Uh, I think I can see the the peak of this, if I'm not mistaken, the peak of uh, Crib Grosh. Yeah, and yesterday uh, I went to the top of the uh, tree farm. That was quite dangerous as well, tree farm, because it was a lot of uh, uh, climbing, a lot of scrambling. So we had to be fit in order to get to the summit. Right, let's do this. Let's try to get on the top. Oh. And the scramble, it's not that difficult, at least up until now, it has, uh, has been quite comfortable. Because there are a lot of rocks like this, where you can uh, grab on with your fingers, a lot of options where you can place your feet, uh, so it's not that bad. Okay. 
Oh shit. Obviously, some parts are a bit more difficult. Some parts are a bit more steep. Some parts are a bit more slippery. So you got to watch out. You don't want to slide down. <laughs> A bit more higher and a bit more scrambling. <laughs> ah. Some parts are not for faint-hearted. Some parts are really steep. They require some physical preparations for sure. Oh, very brave boy. How old is he? How old are you? Seven. And you're doing this mountain already? Oh dear. Oh, some safety platform. Woo. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm officially on the top of Kriyev Gosh, one of the most dangerous mountains in the United Kingdom. Let me show you why it's called one of the most dangerous, because of this ridge here. See? You got to be extremely careful. One slip, one trip, and that would be the end of the story. So sometimes you have to sit down and slide. Slide with your butt. They reach the top, to reach the top, it wasn't that scary. A lot of scrambling, but not that uh, difficult. But to get more uh, excitement, more ext extreme, you have to cross this ridge, like the people in front of me does. They're going all the way to another peak, I think, along the ridge. Okay. And if you, if you saw, a few minutes ago, I passed those uh, Chinese people. They had a boy, he's seven years old, and he made it to the top of uh, Krib Gosh. So if he can do, <laughs> anyone can. <laughs> but I don't think he's gonna go this way here. 
and uh, a good thing is uh, it's dry and sunny it's 21st of December uh, temperature is uh, I think um, on the bottom it was plus 3 so I guess it's about 0 degrees here but sunny sun makes you warm at least not too cold so it's all good As I said, this mountain is not for faint-hearted people because some parts are extremely sharp sharp ridge cannot afford to make a slightest mistake see? you go one way or an another and it's done oh. Whew. Legs a bit shaky. <laughs> oh. Oh dear. To get hold. <laughs> He's a bit scary. I want to be there <laughs> on the flat aisle. Don't think it's a good idea to hold. Oh. I don't think it's a good idea to hold a camera in one hand. Oh. I don't really like this mountain now. <laughs> I don't really want to go this way no more. Oh, as more you crawl, as more scary it gets. Okay, let's carry on. Having short break, I've done halfway, I think, along that ridge. See that ridge over there? Da -da 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 and came up here. I think this is halfway. Is it scary? It is a bit. Especially some parts are scary. See the heights. Imagine you slip from the from the top. Yeah, when you, when you think about uh, you, you might slip, you might fall, then your heart starts racing. That's when it becomes uh, scary. So you have to sometimes breathe in, breathe out, you know. What we're gonna do once we reach? I don't even know where we're going to actually. Along these rocks, I see people not now, but before I saw they probably went around the around the mountain. But we have to we have to go along these uh, ridges, along these tops to the. I see the pathway which leads to another mountain I think okay let's go and see because I've got no clue where we're going to and how we're gonna descend down no idea views are nice though glorious mountains of Wales
It seems like I came across uh, another difficult part. I have to get across that that top of the rocks. It doesn't look easy. What next? Uh. Yeah. Uh. Uh. Easy, give you brushes. Easy, give you brushes. Easy. Stefan, thank you. Descending now, getting down. We came to the top somewhere over that point and then walked along that ridge. You see the, between this gap, gap between these two big rocks. That was a difficult part to climb and scramble up. Then further down, down, and then this wally, green wally, you see this sort of uh, pathway. It's not a pathway, but it looks like pathway. And descending here. And on the way down, I found this tin. That that will be my reward for climbing the Crip Gosh. It's a tin of uh, Atlantic O Skipjack. Not sure what it is, but I'll bring it home and eat it. Uh, the tin is uh, rusty already. So I don't know how long it's been between the rocks, between the stones. But best before end date is uh, June 2023. So it should be still okay. Ah, oh, the frozen. The grass, frozen. Oh, look, some ice. See the puddles, they're frozen. And back to the safe zone, back to the ground, solid ground. That was awesome. Very interesting and exciting experience. Uh, yeah, we managed to come back uh, just before complete darkness. So that's a good point. And also I brought my uh, reward that's gonna be my trophy 